NEW YORK MAN AMBUSHED IN BROAD DAYLIGHT, BASHED IN THE BACK OF HIS HEAD WITH A BASEBALL BAT. SURVEILLANCE VIDEO SHOWS THE SUSPECT PULLED THE BAT OUT OF HIS PANTS, THEN WHACKED THE VICTIM FROM BEHIND, LEAVING HIM BLOODIED AND BRUISED ON THE GROUND. AS NEWS NATION'S NICOLE JOHNSON FROM OUR NEW YORK CITY AFFILIATE WPIX EXPLAINS, THE TWO MEN INVOLVED IN THIS ATTACK WERE COMPLETE STRANGERS. This alarming surveillance video shows a man pulling a bat from his pants and hitting a man in the back of his head. The victim falls to the ground, clearly hurt. Then it seems the bat-toting man goes back towards the victim for a second time. This time, the man kicks the victim. Police say it happened early morning, about a week ago, here near Amsterdam Avenue and West 148th Street. When we showed the video to people who live in the neighborhood, the reaction was the same. Oh, that's ridiculous. The way he's taunting him, it's got to be somebody that had he had a grudge against. Police believe the men are not known to each other, but it appears they did have a verbal dispute before the attack. You can see the man with the bat yelling something at the victim as he rolls around on the ground. Then he takes another step towards the victim before he walks away. Crazy. It was crazy. I don't know what's happening around here anymore. It's, it's ridiculous. Sources tell PIX11 News the victim is a 47-year-old homeless man. He's well known in the area. He was left bleeding from a gash on his head until a business owner called 911. This deli worker saw police arrive shortly after. I feel bad. Yeah, I feel bad for anybody to get hit. Right now, the motive behind the attack is still unclear, but what is clear to longtime resident Beverly Concepcion is this attack may be the result of something more serious. It's all the um, homelessness that all of the mental health people who are outside on the streets after COVID, they got kicked out of the mental hospitals, and they're out now. The victim is expected to be okay. He was taken to Harlem Hospital, treated and released. In the meantime, police are still looking for the man with the bat. In Hamilton Heights, New York, Nicole Johnson, News Nation. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find News Nation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of News Nation's fact driven, unbiased coverage.